Hello guys, um, in today's video we're going to be checking out Jollibee. Jollibee is the biggest fast food franchise in the Philippines and we're going to check it out today and you're coming along with us. Oh, Jollibee is by far the, the most dominant QSR brand in the Philippines today. Its store network of 1,150 is more than the combined total of its next two competitors' store network. Well, it was in 1975 when uh, our founder, Mr. Tony Tancaktiong, along with his wife Grace, um, opened two small ice cream parlors in Manila. Uh, as more and more customers were asking for warm meals, the family decided to serve uh, sandwiches and burgers. And soon, the hamburgers were outselling the ice cream and Jollibee was born. Jollibee has expanded gradually over the years. We have uh, 234 Jollibee out outlets outside the Philippines in 15 countries. Fried chicken is a very popular product in the Philippines. You see fried chicken restaurants in almost every corner in the Philippines. And uh, uh, we developed our own. Uh, that was way back in 1980 when it was first introduced. This you've got to try, Jollibee Chicken Joy. Like all Jollibee products, Chicken Joy has the famous Jollibee cooked in taste. The main difference is nobody has ever tasted fried chicken as good as Jollibee's fried chicken. Chicken Joy is uh, our number one product among the flagships and is the best seller everywhere in the world. Okay guys, so this is it. Jollibee's. Well, actually Jollibee, not bees. <laughs> yeah, Jollibee, we just pulled up. Um, it's been a long time coming and we are finally here. Jollibee. Okay guys, so we just ordered um, and we're waiting for our meal in 15 minutes. We had the, the noodles, what is it called, like pala, palabak, palabak? <laughs> and uh, a six piece, six piece um, original uh, chicken family meal with chicken, french fries and we had one of the desserts, the, the mango pocket. So 15 minutes, we'll be eating. Yay. Pineapple juice. <laughs> okay, so this is a map of where Jollibee. So, see, Philippines, Saudi Arabia, Dubai, Las Vegas, 
California, Canada, New York, Hawaii, Hong Kong, Singapore, Vietnam. Hey guys, yeah, it's extremely busy for a Sunday. Like, I don't think I've Apart from McDonald's, I don't think I've seen fast food, any fast food restaurant this busy, especially on a Sunday. Um, there's like a lineup of people waiting. Um, and as I said, it's in the middle of the Filipino supermarket. They have like a Filipino food stand outside that um, serves Filipino street food. They have a few other Filipino fast food franchises in the supermarket and just like Anything that you can think of that you need from the Philippines, they have it. Um, and uh, we're going to take a tour of the, the supermarket also after we finish trying our Jollibee. Jollibee! Look at that! That looks good, right? Yay! Yeah. Yeah. Okay, yeah, so Mariah's going to try the palabok. That's a noodle with eggs. That look like what? Chicken or? Good. What does it taste like? Tastes like ramen noodles or? No. Tastes like any other noodles that you've had before? Well, this one has like a different flavor to it than the other ones. I don't really like how to describe it. What about the consistency of the noodles itself? What does it taste like? Tastes like noodles? Okay. Then then. Yeah. The french fries. Mm. Where are you want to start? Yeah. Just grab chicken. It's hot, right? Yeah, it just came out of the, the fryer. How's the chicken? Good. Tastes, tastes anything like KFC or? Uh, just a little bit. Tastes a little bit different yeah. from KFC? Jaden, how about your fries? Yeah. Huh? How's it taste like? Amazing? Okay, so, yep, I like the bucket it's like very neat I don't think I've ever seen a six piece in a bucket before so I like that um, the chicken crunchy fresh just came out of the deep fryer so mm. it's hot very hot. <laughs> Flavor is good. Flavor is very good. And it's well cooked. Like into the bones, you can see like very hot. No blood anywhere, like cooked right through. Very good. <laughs> Last piece. Oh. Very hot, very crunchy.
Of course, you can't be a fast food restaurant without a mascot. And here is Mr. Jollibee. Very colorful and happy. Okay, so today we tried the fried chicken. I think we're gonna have to come back to try their chicken sandwich. So far, so good. It was much busier when we came in. It's a bit emptier now. And, yep. Yeah, I think we have to try their chicken tender too. Try a little bit of everything. Okay, so now we're gonna try the dessert it's a peach mango pie heard a lot about this too so what if they make this in the in the philippines oh i like the crust whoa look at that which one do you want this one or you go first Yeah, it's very good. It's kind of sweet? Yeah, kind of. Alright, let's go in. Oh, wow. Yeah. The crust is not too sweet. It's not too sweet. It's a little sweet, but not, not very sweet. Um, the mango. Oh. Yeah, it's very good. It doesn't taste like like fast food dessert. Like normally, like you know, the McDonald's and the KFC it tastes like very light and very sweet and very light. It doesn't really tastes like desserts that you get like at a restaurant or hotel. This the crust. It's very rich and the mango. And mango and peach, they're very similar in taste, like similar texture, similar taste. But you can taste the the mango overpowering the, the, the peach. Yeah, the taste of the mango is very good. Very good. Hey guys, so yeah, so this is actually cool. So now um, I'm in a Filipino supermarket. We came to check out the Jollibee. You know, Jollibee is a Filipino um, fried chicken franchise. Uh, they're very popular. There's like 1,500 across the world. Um, I've been hearing about it for a long time, but for whatever reason, I did not get to try it yet so today we decide that okay let's try it out today so and it's located in this Filipino supermarket and it's busy very busy <laughs> yeah like I feel like I'm in the Philippines 
So let's just. Live entertainment. Okay guys, so we are back home and I must say like I was not disappointed, it was very good. Um, I like that the the Jollibee, the, the, the restaurant, it was in a, it was in a, like a, a supermarket uh, yeah, type, like a plaza, like a, a, a indoor supermarket slash there was like four other, like a food court, yeah. um, all things Filipino. Filipino restaurant, Filipino street food, everything Filipino. So and singing and and yeah, I found interesting that like they had karaoke like in the middle of the the supermarket, <laughs> which was funny. Um, yeah, but it was good. Um, and in terms of the 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 Jollibee chicken, we're gonna give our rating um, first. French fries. Jaden is our French fries specialist. Jaden, you said. How would you rate the French fries? I'd rate it one billion of. Jaden, it's it's always <laughs> look, it, it's always one to ten, not one billion. <laughs> okay, then ten out of ten. Ten, ten out of ten. Yeah, ten out of ten. That means perfect. Yes. Really? Yes. Is it better than McDonald's? Almost. 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 Oh, so that means a nine then. <laughs> if McDonald's is a ten and it's not better, it's says a nine. <laughs> So nine? <laughs> okay, nine. Nine? <laughs> okay. Brian? Uh, well, they taste like every other fry that you get at a fast food, so maybe like 7.5. And uh, the chicken? No, the uh, fries. Yeah, but what about the chicken though? What would you say for the... The chicken? Probably <laughs> like an 8.5. It was very crunchy, and the uh, inside was very flavored. So maybe nine, actually. Nine? What about the, the noodles? What's it called again? The the palabok? Palabok? Yeah, yeah. palabok. Yeah. What about the palabok? Maybe eight. Yeah. What did you like about it? What didn't you like about it? Well, first off, uh, I, I like soft food, so. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so you like that it was soft? The noodles yeah. were soft? But other than, but the bad thing, the con, that uh, it had pork. Well, no, not that, but because I didn't try the pork, but uh, probably. Well, maybe it was like a little bit dry. Was dry? <laughs> dry. I don't know what to say. Okay. Well, well, for me, um, I wasn't disappointed with the with the the overall result. The service was good. Um, it's hard to get good service at fast food restaurants. I like, yeah, most fast food restaurants, you know, so I like that when we came in, they say, they said, um, you jolly, jolly good afternoon, you know, jolly good afternoon. Um, that was a nice touch. Um, it, it was like service with a smile. The cashiers were very pleasant, friendly. Um, the chicken, I would give the chicken, I would say 7.5 or... 7.5 to 8 out of 10. Um, it was definitely better than KFC. Um, I would say I'm not sure about um, Popeyes as yet. It's better than the spicy Popeyes, but I'm not sure about the regular. I think it's very close. Yeah, so, and the, the leg, the leg was seasoned perfectly. It was almost perfect, but when it came on to like the, the white meat part of the, the, the chicken, you know, when you bite into the chicken and that fleshy part, it, it had, like most of the, 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 
the KFC, the Popeyes, it just not, it's cooked through well, but it tastes, you can taste a bit of a raw chicken taste in it. Um, it's not like, I know about like KFC, like in, in Jamaica, where when you go into, when you bite right into the chicken, it's like just seasoned and delicious right through. You can bite into the bone how seasoned it is. This was a bit different with the, the white meat part of the chicken. But the leg was perfect. Um, the, the fries was good. Mm -hmm. The, what else? My favorite part of it was the, the, the dessert. The, oh yeah, the, um, the mango the peach. peach. Mango oh, peach, that was my favorite part of yeah. it because whether it's KFC, McDonald's or, I don't know if Popeyes have dessert. I've never had their dessert before. But either. but it's it's always like I know for like McDonald's, KFC is like overly sweet. Um and just tastes like fake type of dessert. This one tastes like something homemade. Yeah. You know, like it wasn't restaurant type. Restaurant type, homemade. It wasn't too sweet. Um the mango and the peach, even though they're similar in texture, like you could feel taste like the mango, just like taste of the mango coming to the top. So yeah, it was very good. And what I like about living in a multicultural place like, like, like Canada, like in Toronto, is that most places in different cities in the world, you, you only get to see like KFC, Burger King, like an American franchise. But the fact that in Toronto, you can have like a Filipino fast food franchise that you can go and you can taste what you know people in the Philippines are eating. You have like a, a Korean um, fast food franchise also. You have fast food franchise from India. So I like that about living in, in Toronto. So if you guys have ever tried Jollibee, like leave a comment in the comment section. Let us know, you know, what what's your your your, your feedback on you know their, their service, their food. Is it comparable to KFC? Is it comparable to Popeyes? What do you think? Just leave it in the comment section and We'll see you in another video. Peace. Peace. Out. Out.